So here we are at London Luton Airport. We're getting a flight to Sicily, to Catania, and then we're going to cycle along the coast of Sicily to Mondello. So I will catch you en route. It looks to be a good hot route and we'll see how we go in Italy. This is for charity so this will be more of a chill out ride. I'll catch you en route in Sicily. So here we are at Montania, just loading up the bikes. Onto the coach. It's about 30, 32 degrees. And we've got a volcano. They're in the background there, it's bending off. So, here we are leaving Catania off to Messina along this Sicilian coast. Very, very warm already. Already sweltering, but looks very nice. And we're going to roll along this Sicilian coast to Messina. <laughs> Rolling through Catania. So, rolling along, you can see over there is Mount Etna. Hopefully, it won't look to erupt until we're past it. This is Messina, really nice. And time for some lunch. It's warm, very warm. Wow, it looks impressive. view from the hotel balcony. So here we are in the centre of Palermo. Followed this uh, Sicilian coast to this 
quirky city, which is the capital of Sicily, I believe. It's certainly uh, got a lot of historic buildings, that's for sure. coastline anti-clockwise going through Messina and take you and then through Palermo to Mondello so what's it like cycling in Sicily well one thing that's constant is the heat uh, it's extreme um, so it's not really the, the distance that you cover on a daily basis I mean we've covered around about 400 k's over these few days it's been fantastic um, lovely scenery and the roads are in a good place, you know, good surfaces. Um, through the town it's a little bit cobbledy, but apart from that it's very good. It's just your heat management, you have to find a way to not generate more heat than you actually need. Certainly for someone like myself, I'm more efficient under 20 degrees and you experience temperatures out here that are well over 40. So it's very tough cycling in there to try and cool or regulate your body heat. But outside of that, yeah, it's a great place to come. There's a few options you can fly across into Catania um, when you're flying back out of Palermo. Or there's options to drive and get ferries, although I think the driving works out to about a thousand miles. So a fair amount of driving, um, there is that option. But Sicily. Come to check it out. Different to my normal locations, that's for sure. This one was for charity. We're raising good money for a couple of very good causes um, with a team. So take care, all the best, enjoy adventures from a very sunny and a very hot Mondello in Sicily.